Hello. If you're gonna make some tie-dye shirts, keep watching. Like my eyebrows. I know. If I'm gonna do a tutorial on this, let me know, because I will do a tutorial on how to make these cool tie-dye, not really kind of looking galaxy, whatever hell you wanna say, call them eyebrows. Keep watching if you want to make tie-dye shirt. Not eyebrows, tie-dye shirt. Keep watching. First we're going to need is some shirts. I got ages 15 to 18. Some tie-dye, of course. Plastic bags. Some rubber bands. First what you're going to want to do is you want to soak your shirts in cold water. Wring them out very good. You don't want them to be too wet at all. Do that to all of your shirts. Then lay it out on a flat surface. Now when you're doing this, you want to go counterclockwise and you want to turn the fabric the opposite direction, if that makes sense. Just watch. It's kind of confusing. I didn't get it the first time either. You're going to turn it the opposite direction you're putting the clothes. Yeah, it's kind of confusing. <laughs> then you're going to get three rubber bands and put that around it very carefully. It doesn't matter how you put it, and that's what, that's what it should look like. Do this to all of your shirts. Now get your dye. They all have the same amount of powder in them. You're gonna get boiling hot water and pour it in. I burn myself a couple times, so be careful when you're doing this. And you wanna shake them very thoroughly. How you put the dye on there is how it's gonna come out. Don't put the colors too close together or it'll look really weird colors and look like gross, you know? So I'm just doing mine in random ways. I'm putting mine in different colors. I'm not doing any specific thing. It's all what you want. After you do all that stuff, you're going to want to put all of your shirts in plastic bags. I kept mine overnight so the color stays in longer. After those overnight, you're going to put them in cold water and you're going just to move them around just to get all the color out before you put them in the dryer or the washer. When you put them after this into the dryer, you or the washer, it needs to be on cold water for the washer. This is just so it gets all the color out. This will dye your fingers and you want to wring it out very good. Make sure you get all of the dye out. Thank you for watching my tie dye shirt video. I'm really, I'm like really hyper today. I'm so sorry. Give this video a thumbs up. Make sure to comment down below if we're gonna do these eyebrows like I did in the beginning of the video. And yeah, hope you this video. If I'm gonna do more DIYs, let me know. Sorry about the video getting deleted. My vlog video. It was some personal reasons, not really personal, but family reasons, and I had to get rid of it. So yeah, as I'm making a new one. So woo! Foot in the air. Oh crap. My wig almost fell off. Yes, honey. When I was wearing, those were wigs. Sorry. Okay. Bye, guys. Toodles.